So with no video posted in the last couple of weeks and no car intro of us talking and ranting, you can tell that we've been really pressed for time. With my new job and the 10 hour work days, it's starting to take its toll on me. I know Scott was dealing with that with his old job the past couple years where work is interfering with how lifting's going. I'm not injured, but my body just has no energy. The weight feels way heavier than what it should. And I just kind of feel like I'm at a point I'm not really improving. I, I hope prep, I'll get back on track and start improving. But these numbers I've done before and they just don't feel good. It's, it's really hard to lift when the weight feels bad. Um, like I said, you're not making much progress in the gym, but that just shows how much you really love lifting if you keep at it, keep pushing your body, keep pushing through the pain and you just keep going and you can see people surpassing your weight. But with us, we love lifting so much. And yeah, we fight, we argue, we cry over lifting, but it's our passion. And it's something that even though we say we want to quit, I don't see us really ever stopping. For Scott this day, he was, of course, not feeling good. So I was happy with with how heavy that he was able to pull. Um, really proud that he was able to push through this fail lift and get back on track and rep it. Um, I'll let some of the other lifts play out, and then I'll come back in. day I wanted to pull at least 425 I only got up to 410 um, I actually failed a lift before this I was getting in my head and I pulled 435 before so that's where I'm getting frustrated where there's lifts that I've done in the past I, I just I'm not I'm just not doing them and same thing goes for Scott on bench even though with him his body hurts so he has an, ex an excuse I don't have one but he's done this weight plenty of times and the weight just does not feel good. Um, to be honest, like sometimes going to this gym and you can say I'm being dramatic, but it's just, I feel energies and I just, I feel sick. Like I can't get a good lift in. And it's, it's happened at other gyms before where I, it gets to a point where I honestly, I just can't, I can't lift and we switch. But one of the things that keeps us coming back is, um, a few days a week, the Special Olympic um, lifters, they, they come here and we become kind of close with, with two of the people. And you can see Scott talking to one of them. They're just really great people, um, inspiring, uh, kind, non-judgmental, And we really enjoy seeing them each week and, and talking with them. Um, here's me benching. I was trying out a new form, keeping my feet down. It took a lot less pressure off my back, but... It was it was harder to to lift heavy, so just kind of playing around with it on this day. So I don't want you to think this whole video is us complaining, but this is just what we're going through in life, and we're gonna say how we're feeling. Um, you haven't seen much squats out of Scott. Um, he's and he's not doing a full power meet this year. It's just uh, the squatting hurts his body more than any of the other lifts with his back, his knee, and his wrist has been hurting a lot. And we kind of figured out it's from um, his job crawling under houses and lifting his body up. So he just did a few sets. Um, he used to hit squats at least twice a week, but your bodies, they change and what used to feel good just doesn't. Um, I ended up doing some squats also. Um, 
didn't go as heavy as I wanted to as usual. Um, and I am doing a full power meet in a couple months. So this is my last week of off season and then my prep starts. So I'm just hoping that my body will allow me to get through whatever Scott has programmed for me. And because usually when I do fail something on program, like it, ne it, just, it never ends well. So hoping for not a smooth prep, but just a prep that I can go through and Hopefully, um, I do improve at the end of it, and it will be my first meet as a master lifter. And people think I have it easy because oh, you're lifting against forty, you're like forty to forty-five year olds. But some of these women, yeah, they're on sub, but they're they're really strong. So I don't have an easy competition by any means. So it is it is still going to be a challenge, and it still is going to be um, some good competition. So. Stay tuned with my upcoming prep. Um, I don't know how much Scott will be filmed, but I'll make sure to get some of his lifts in so you're not just watching me, but really appreciate you all for sticking around. And the last video did pretty well for us, so I was proud about that. So stay tuned and prep is starting next week. Yeah. 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 Yeah.